Kristen. Um, today I'm going to be doing my everyday makeup tutorial for you, testing out some new products and showing you what I use on a daily basis. So the first stuff I um, already had moisturized and sprayed my face. Um, next, I'm going to uh, use the, the new um, Revolution Makeup. It is the new um, makeup stick that's out. Um, I have it in the color F12 and it matches really well. They give you, let's see, I use a little bit of this. Um, they give you an okay amount of product. I mean, it's, it's okay. I utilize a pretty good amount. So next, um, what I do is I put it all over my face. more here and a little bit here then next what I do is I have the real techniques it is huge um, compared to let me get the smaller size little makeup blender here I have the body one which I absolutely love so what I do is take this and just blend it all out and this foundation is awesome Let me get my mirror so I can see what I'm doing here and show you guys at the same time. It matches my skin perfectly and it buffs right in. It's awesome. So there it is. It actually looks really nice. It blends in very well. And then next, um, what I utilize for my um, concealer is the Revolution Conceal and Define. This here is actually compared to um, the Tarte Shape Tape, which I own that as well. And this stuff is really good. So the next, what I do with this is I put this underneath my eyes and I utilize the color use the color C5 so let's see here put this under my eyes okay and also blend it out with the makeup blender beauty blender So there it is. It's really nice. It really covers everything. Um, so next, what I do is I set it with the uh, Maybelline Fit Me in the color uh, medium. It's the loose powder. This stuff is great. Um, so what I do is put a little bit on the top, tap it in. Then I set my under eyes where I put that concealer with a little bit of loose powder. So I do that. And then what I do next is I use my big brush here. This one here is um, the 306 brush from Real Techniques. And then take it and dab it in. And then just put it all over, all over the face. To set that foundation and this powder is really nice um, haven't been using anything else but look I mean it looks great I like it put a little bit more on okay so next uh, what we're gonna do is the eyes. Actually, you know what? I forgot. I use this Bye Bye Pores pressed powder. Um, it makes your pores disappear. This stuff is phenomenal. I actually want to get the full size. I got it in, um, I think it was one of those Ipsy's or Boxy Charms or 
one of those. Um, it's a sample, and I just put it here where my pores are a little bit larger, and it doesn't make any color. It's great. So, as you can tell, you can't really see anything. Okay. Next, um, I'm going to do my blush and my bronzer. For that, um, bronzer, I used the Bahama Mama and a brush, a uh, powder brush that I got um, from Marshalls. And take that. just bronze then bronze here bronze here a little down here a little bit on the nose okay and the next thing I'm going to use is the bye bye fours blush by it cosmetics it Cosmetics, this stuff is phenomenal. I'm going to use the color Naturally Pretty, and this is what it looks like. I've used quite a bit from this. Really pretty. So I take it and just put a little bit on the cheeks. Right there. A little bit on the cheeks. It's pretty. A little bit on the cheeks. Okay, and next for my um, highlight, I use the Becca. It's the Champagne Pop. Mine's kind of a little broke, so I can't really show you what it is, but that's my Champagne Pop. And then I'm going to use my Real Techniques brush here. down the nose. Bring it in here. Okay. Then next what I'm gonna do is I have this little like stippling brush. I'm just gonna take it and blend it all together. Circle motions. Everything blends together. Okay. So next what I'm gonna do is um, the eyes. And what I'm going to use for the eyeshadow palette, I was going to use the Morphe palette. Um, let's see here. It's the 25B. Let me show you guys what it looks like. So here it is. Very pretty colors. See? Very pretty. And for the lid, I'm going to use this Catrice Liquid Metal Shadow in uh, We Are the Champagnes. Very pretty. And then I'll open it up and show you. So I'm going to dig into the Morphe palette right now, and I'm going to use my MAC brush, um, 224 brush right here, and I'm going to start out here with this color. In the crease here. Do a little bit more. It's kind of really light. Okay. To, um, close the window here because somebody's getting their grass cut. So um, still going in with the Morphe palette. Let's see here. Okay, still going in with that. And the next shade I'm going to use in the crease to try to like warm it up a little bit is this color right here. Let's see. Warm it up a little bit more. So this is going to be a more of a natural look today. And then next, I'm going to take my MAC, the, actually the Morphe M433, 
brush and I'm gonna go in to this brown color right here and do this part of my eye here. Bring it a little bit to the crease. do this one a little bit more okay then next um, what I'm gonna do is take the Catrice eyeshadow and I'm going to take my finger with this one and rub it on the eyeshadow and see how much it gives off wow that's a lot and I'm just gonna tap it right here on my lid. Okay, see how much it gives off? It's pretty nice. Um, I'm also going to take a brush and go over it as well. Okay, a little bit more. I'm putting the Catrice liquid metal shadow on my eye here. Actually, in my mirror. <laughs> putting it on the lid. Packing it on. You also can put down concealer or like a eye glue. Um, and so this is the eye. And I'm gonna do, for my mascara, I'm going to use, this is another great mascara. I think this is better than Too Faced, better than Sex Mascara because that one's clumpy. Um, this is the Essence, the False Lashes Extreme Volume and Curl. This stuff is like four bucks and it is phenomenal. I got it at Ulta. Great stuff. So um, that's what I'm gonna put on my eyes. Uh, I'm probably not gonna do a liner today cause I really don't need a dramatic look. So that's that. These are, this, I'm telling you, this stuff is awesome. Like, I know you really can't see it in the camera, but awesome. Okay, so um, I'm going to do my eyebrows and um, come right back. Um, what I use is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in Chocolate. I'm almost out of it. Stuff is great. So um, what I'm going to do is use my brush, comb my eyebrows. Fill them in. Okay. There we go. There it is. Okay. And take a little bit more for the other eye. And here we go. I think this brush, oh, this is this is the It Cosmetics brush. For your eyes it's got like a tapered like brush end it's really cute um it works really well so let me show the next eyebrow a little bit goes a long way with this stuff a little bit goes a long way. Okay, just keep brushing it. There we go. So my eyebrows are done, my eyes are done. And next is lipstick. So um, I'm gonna go grab my lipstick and I'll be right back. I'm gonna use the Urban Decay. It is the Ultra Cushion Lip Gloss in the color Back Talk. It's really pretty. So just a simple look today. Love it. Okay, so let's see how messy my hair is. Well, 
that completes the look. Um, thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm going to try to do these um, a little bit more and um, show you some hauls and stuff like that. Um, but thanks for watching. Bye.